Certificates of entitlement prices closed lower in all but the open category in the latest tender today. Close attention is being paid to motorcycle premiums, which came in at just over $6,500. And that's 15% lower versus the previous tender two weeks ago when prices shot past $7,700. That first tender in July had been the first one in three months because of circuit breaker measures. One motorcycle dealer says he expects demand and premiums to remain high. He says one possible reason could be because motorcycle COEs require a relatively low deposit. There probably could be one-ton bidding in the sense that only $200 are required for a Cat B COE. The six-month expiry, which are transferable, as usual, was extended for three months to nine months. And quick look at the other categories. Categories A, B and C saw COE prices dip by about 2.5% each on average. The only exception was the open category, which ended slightly higher at about $35,000. One car dealer says he expects premiums to go up in the coming tenders because fewer cars were deregistered during the circuit breaker. We will see maybe COE prices to be moving higher maybe in the next round, right? Because uh, the allocation for August, September, and October should be out soon and the numbers should be a bit smaller, right? So I, we, we would think that COE prices will be still see, moving upwards 